Using Microsoft Word is pretty easy, but sooner or later you get to the point where moving that mouse around to do everything gets a little bit tiring. One way to free up your mouse hand and help reduce the risk of repetitive strain injury is to use keyboard shortcuts. The keyboard short uh, the what? Keyboard shortcuts. Quick and simple keystrokes that let you do most of the same things without using the mouse. And sometimes even faster. So let's go! At number 10, it's Control O. Hold down the control key and press the letter O once. This brings up the dialog box that lets you open an existing document. Slow, slow. Number 9, Control W. Got a document open, you're finished with it, hold Control, press W, and the document is closed. Number 8 is Control U. So, you're working on a document and you want to underline an important word or sentence. No problem. Select the text, hold Control, and press the letter U. Hey, horizontal rules at your command. Number 7 is Control I. Select your text, hold Control, and press the letter I. Bingo! Your words are now italicized. Number 6, it's Control B. Select your text, hold Control, and press B. And hey presto, your text is now bold. At number 5, we have the F4 key that lets you do things again and again. If the last thing you did was make some text bold, then selecting another piece of text and pressing the F4 key once will make this text bold too. In short, if you want to repeat the last thing you just did, press F4. At number 4, Control c to copy text. Select the text you want to copy, hold down Control and press the letter C. Your text is now placed on the clipboard, ready for... Number 3. Control v to paste text. Whatever text you most recently copied is now available to paste. Click where you'd like the text to appear, hold Control and press the letter V. And voila! Clones of your favourite words. At number 2. Control z Done something you wish you hadn't? No problem. Hold Control and press Z. And you undo the last thing you just did. And at number 1. It's Control S, probably the most important shortcut of all. Hold Control and press the letter S to save your document. If the document hasn't been saved previously, the Save dialog box will open to let you choose where to save the document and what name to give it. If your document has been saved before, then pressing Control S will simply update the existing version without any prompting. So there you have it, the top 10 beginner's keyboard shortcuts. Get these ones down first and you'll be flying around Word in no time. Oh, and by the way, every one of these shortcuts works in Excel too. So you're learning skills for two products at the same time.